Hello everyone. Welcome to my new episode. Today I am going to prepare a dish called Amejos con coco. Amejos means clams. These are the clams. Amejos. Clams with coconut. So it's very simple dish and but only thing it is very difficult to clean it the clams. Clams in in my village lot of clams available in season time especially in the month of Ju april may actually it is available only on low tide that time they are harvesting that time the people goes boys goes young boys they goes to remove it from the sand it is always under the sand so they scrape it the sand and they will find it the clams inside always bring it up and wash it well you have to wash it at least four five times to remove the sand from top of it it is very difficult otherwise to eat so it is better to wash it well before using it now i have taken the black clams from our river river it is very fresh you have to find out the clams you should buy it uh, even if you go in the market you should not buy it open one it should be that it should be tight I'll just open it. See, this is the way you have to open. And I removed one shell, and one shell I have thrown out. First, I will keep the saucepan on the fire, and I'll put the oil in it. Then I'll put the one teaspoon of chopped garlic, one teaspoon of chopped ginger in it, and let it get fried for some time. These are all the ingredients goes for the clams: ginger, garlic, one tablespoon of coriander seeds, one teaspoon of cumin seeds, half teaspoons of peppercorn, and three four number. Chili, uh, red chilies. I have not taken any hot masala in it, and just roast it. And I made powder out of it. Just powder out of it. Only one, two, three, four, five items I have taken, and I just made the powder out of it. I'll taken two number chop onions, and I add it to it. And saute it. And saute for some time till it gets light brown in color. Onions are almost fried. Now I'll add a little turmeric powder in it, say half teaspoon, and chopped tomato in it, one number. And just saute it for some time. And I'll add little green chili, say one nama green chili in it, so that you get a little spicy taste. And the masala which I have just roasted, the powder made it out of it. So I'm adding it one teaspoon, tablespoon of it. Suppose if you don't want masala, you can avoid it. You can put only green chili and turmeric powder, and then you add your clean clams to it. And cook it well. Eat. Till it gets semen dry. Now I'll add salt to it. Say one, one and a half teaspoon of salt, and say one tablespoon of turmeric, turmeric pulp, and I'll cover it and cook it for some time. The clams. I'll cover it and cook it for some time till it gets cooked well. 
yeah it's semi dry now almost clams are cooked now what i'll do it i'll add say about four five spoons of tablespoons of coconut milk fresh say two three spoons of dry fresh grated coconut i'll just finish with little bit of chopped coriander in it clams are ready if you want you can make completely dry or if you want to make it semi dry like this you can keep it semi dry so that you can eat it with the bread and rice also in olden days they used to serve it completely dry with the kanji with the pears we call it in local language kanji means leftover rice used to cook it with the water till it become like thick and we used to serve it about 10 o'clock 12 o'clock and we used to serve this clams with that it tastes fantastic with the kanji but you can serve it with all bread also you can serve it with the rice also now the clams are ready so i'm going to remove it serve it in a bowl to the guests it's almost ready and we can serve it to the guest now i'll serve with this with goan bread clams are ready to serve to my guest Thank you very much for watching this preparation called clams in coconut. Please try it at home and send me the comments. And thank you very much for subscribing to my channel.